Hi folks, this is Mike with Dimonin Precision Painting and today we're going to be showing you how to cut in a line, straight line around your trim without tape or caulking. But before we do, don't forget to hit that subscribe button down there and here we go. Alright folks, first thing, uh, first things first, uh, just how you hold the brush. Uh, I hold it sort of like you would hold a pencil. So one of these numbers, except you just want to throw two fingers like on this ferrule here, maybe three relative to how big the brush is. Um, you want three points of contact. One in your thumb gives you better control. The fingers here and the finger on the top here. I don't know if you guys can see that, but yeah, and that's how you're going to want to hold your brush while you're cutting in. Um, make, make sure you keep your hands sort of loose. Um, you don't want to be tight because you'll start shaking. So uh, just remember when you're cutting in, breathe, don't hold your breath, and uh, to the next step. All right, guys, so I got my paint out. I got my, my little cutting bucket here. I got a two and a half inch angle purdy stiff. And the reason I'm using a stiff brush is because this wall's super textured. And uh, so yeah, now we'll get to it. Just holding it like I showed you guys before. Um, you want to load your brush up pretty decent. Give a couple taps on the side there. And you're gonna start a little bit away from the wall and you're gonna wanna get some of that excess paint off and then just kind of work your way slowly towards it. And you use those last few bristles on the end of that guy like that. And I kind of twist as I go down. And then because this wall's so textured, what I'll do is I'll come back the opposite direction using those last bristles again to fill in anywhere that I missed. And that's the key is you really want to just use those last little bit of bristles. And it's sort of a twisting and falling at the same time motion. Just make sure you go back and fill in anywhere you missed. So yeah, so it's like this, and you get that line going. But then you go back, fill in where you missed, like such. This brush is a little damp, so. But yeah, that's essentially how you do it. But if this were against the just like that and go back, make sure you got anything you missed. And that, my friends, is how you cut a straight line around your trim freehand. Hey guys, uh, that's a little technique tip of the day. Um, preferably on if you're doing an accent wall, I do have a video down here on how to tape and use clear caulking for accent walls. If you're doing an it, out in the open of the field, we call it the field, um, it's best to use frog tape and caulking. But around your trim, you can get away with not using it. If you want an even straighter line, you can use frog tape and caulking. Like I said, I do have a video down here. And don't forget to subscribe and tune in for more and we'll be back. Why you still looking at me? Why you still looking at me?